Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to create a quantity based discount in Shopify using Shopify function. Imagine you want to offer your customer a discount based on the quantity of the item they purchase. For example, if they buy three items, they got 10% discount. And if they buy five or more items, they get a 15% discount. This is a great way to encourage bulk purchases and boost your sales. So in this video, I will walk you through the step to step this functionality using the Shopify functions. So let's dive right in. So go to the terminal, open a terminal and type Shopify app in it. Okay, name of your project. So I'll name it quantity. Discount. And we are not going to install the remix app. We will start by adding your first extension. So it will save some time. Quickly hit enter. So it will take some time to install the dependency. And then we will go to CD quantity discounts folder and then we'll type Shopify app generate extension. And here we will select our partner and select with soft technologies and yes create a new app and name it quantity discount all right then we are going to select discount orders function and we'll name it order discount and you can use uh, JavaScript, TypeScript, Rust, or Wasp. I will select JavaScript. So it is going to install our extension. Okay, now our extension is generated. And go to extensions, order discount, source, and open run.graphql file. Let's remove this code. And we need to get the card and then lines in quantity merchandise in type name and on product variant we need ID. Save that and then go to the extension folder CD extension and CD order discount and type this command then we copy the command from here Shopify uh, function, type in. Okay, next we are going to open run.js and we are going to remove everything from here. Oops. And now we will add a function, export function, run input, 
And here we will type on card and input dot card. Then let discount is equal to zero. And next we need total quantity total quantity is equal to card dot lines and we are going to use a reduce function reduce and then sum line arrow function sum plus line dot quantity and here we'll pass zero this will give us total quantity and we will add condition here if total quantity greater than or equal to five discount will be 0.15 percent now let's see if total quantity less than equal to uh, greater than equal to three then discount would be zero 0.10% and if discount is equal to, is equal to 0 we are going to return empty discount okay now <clears throat> we need to make the discount object so I'll type const discount discounts and card dot lines dot map and line arrow function and we are going to return the object where we will have target targets in targets array we need to pass product variant and that is id merchandise dot id and next value value would be percentage and value would be discount multiply 100 and in the end we will pass the message you have received the discount multiply by 100 percentage and in the end we are going to return that discount discount strategy discount strategy dot first and then we will pass the discounts so after that we will go to the root directory type cd dot dot cd not done 
Now, we need to have the right, right uh, discount provision. And then we will type, so P5 tab deploy. So it will deploy the new scope. Okay. Yes, so release a new version. Okay, it is building the environment. Will take some time. Okay, once it is done, the next command you are going to type npm run dev. Now our app will be started and we need to install that app in our store. So I'll select this store and then it will give me a URL uh, where our app is being installed. So if you press P, it will open the store in a browser and we have a discount permission, install this. Once the app is installed, go back and now press G to open the GraphQL. Now it opened the GraphQL interface and we need to run this command to fetch all the functions. To fetch all the Shopify functions, we need to copy this command and paste that over here. What it will do, it will grab the first 25 Shopify functions and click on this and now we have the order ID we need this order ID which we just uh, we need the function ID which we just created so next command I'm going to do we need to do the mutation let's paste that over here and copy this function ID and replace over here and here I will say query discount. Now run this command again and now our function is executed and now let's check our function. Okay, this is the store where I have installed the function. So I will add a couple of products and this product then go back add a new product and go back again And add the third product. Now we will have, uh, we should have the 10% discount. So as you can see, you have received 10% discount over here. And if you go to checkout, uh, you will see the message. You have received a 10% discount and which is coming from, from here, this message and Let's try to add a few more products in the card. Five. And now we should have the 15% discount. And if you see, we have 15% discount on, on each product. And let's try to change the message. Wow. So let's see if that changed the message over here. I need to go back here. It takes some time to update the message. Okay, now you see the message is updated. And this is how you can build Shopify functions. If you like my video, please share, subscribe to my channel. Also, if you need help, 
you can contact me through Fiverr or Upwork. I will give the links in my description. Thank you for watching.